Hi, this is Nancy, and for this Ask Nancy segment, I want to show you a really close-up version of how I cast the needle, the thread, on my hand sewing needle. So for this segment, we're using a handheld camera so that they'll be able to come really, really close. Now, this is the way that I cast the thread onto my needle when I'm doing hand applique, also when I'm doing bindings. I actually would do it this way if I were hand quilting. And in this particular case, it was the video that I did for sewing on beads. And Scott asked the question, can you show me again how you cast that thread on that needle? Because they just couldn't see. So bring the camera in. All right, so I've got a yarn needle here. It's not going to matter. I just wanted it to be big enough so you could really see. I have my thread threaded through, and this is a big old piece of yarn. This is how I make the knot to keep the thread on the needle. Hold the thread here, and when I put my needle through and bring it through, do you see that the tail of the thread is under the needle? It's in that loop. Now I'm going to hold that, bring it down, so now it's down here. Going to pull the tail so it's going through the eye of the needle. There's that thread casting, went right through that loop. Now bring this down to the bottom of the needle. Now it is secure. Now I know that looks really, really big, and of course you wouldn't be able to stitch with it with a yarn, but if you're using a fine weight thread for hand stitching, when you're stitching, it'll go right over that knot. The next question is, how do I make my knot at the end? So here is the end, the tail end. I'm going to take that tail end, put my needle. So now do you see that the thread and the needle have made an X? I'm going to twist that around. Depending on the size of the thread, I'll twist with silk thread. I'll twist it around eight times or more. Now that little twisting. I'm going to put between my two fingers and pull it down. I'm hoping it's going to go over that little knot that I made to begin with because this is a heavy yarn. Wah! Can't get over that knot. With thread, it's not that hard. There. Okay. So now that twisting is all the way down here, and I'm pulling that thread, pulling that thread through. The tail is sticking out from the hole. Now I have a knot. So that is how I do the casting on of the thread at the beginning and how I do the knot at the end. Now, I could sit here and do this 10 times, so you could watch it 10 more times, or you could just replay and watch it 10 more times. So thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel, and don't forget to hit that little bell for notifications for when we have a new video. Have a great day.